Here's a fun node you might not know about. We have a turntable node, which allows you to create a turntable based on the number of frames in your scene. So right now we have one turn, and that's going to exist between frame one and end at frame 50. So if we go down here and click on this icon at the bottom left of the screen, we can change our scene range to reflect the number of frames. So if I go, let's say from one to 100, hit apply, as you can see, now the turntable is going to last for 100 frames instead of 50. I could change the number of turns up here. Let's say that I wanna do three turns, easy as that. And for fun, if you wanna go crazy with this, you can go ahead and set an offset away from the origin, check on this rotate around origin, and as I press play, we end up with something like this, which could be an interesting premise for some sort of particle emission. If you set down a pop net with a basic pop force, adding a little bit of turbulence, we end up with something like this. So a fun usage of a turntable node that could actually save you a little bit of time if you're trying to create this specific motion. For more quick tips and fun little tricks like this, check out cgforge.com. Thanks for watching.